It is uh, December 2nd, um, about 11 o'clock. We're in a town called Turul. I'm not sure how to say it, T-E-R-U-E-L. And it's the 25th anniversary. This is a World Heritage Site. Ah, it's the 25th year of it, of it being a World Heritage Site. And we're here to look at Mudehar, and I don't know how to say it, M-U-D-E, with an accent on it, J-A-R, Mudehar Architecture. And Joanne's going to tell you a little story what that is. Well, first of all, maybe you can speak historically about what happened on the Iberian Peninsula when the Moors came. The, the Moors came and took over the... The Romans, the Romans were around here till uh, the 400s. Uh, as Rome mm, deteriorated and so on and, and withdrew uh, out, out of the far reaches of what was the Roman Empire, the uh, Vandals and the Visigoths took over for quite a while until the Moors came along and uh, then the Moors conquered most of the Iberian Peninsula. The northern parts of Spain remained Christian, uh, but uh, the rest of the country... For about uh, 400 years. Four or right? 500 years, something like that, was run by the Moors, okay? And then it wasn't until... Uh, uh, Isabella and... Uh, what Ferdinand. Was Ferdinand joined forces. Uh, she being from Castile, he from Aragon, they joined forces and years before uh, the Christians started conquering back uh, the Moors, but in 1492 uh, uh, Granada fell and uh, the Alhambra and it was all Christian again. But anyway, during that that, re that reconquest, that reconquest, it lasted, uh, the reconquest, I think, started around 1100, right. something like that, culminated with the, uh, uh, in Granada, and in 1492, the reconquista came to an end. But, so during that time period, there was a mixture of art and construction techniques and that kind of stuff. Right. And so what you see in Muja, Mujajar, architecture is a combination of the Moorish and the Gothic. And, and actually it also uh, demonstrates a peaceful coexistence with the Jewish culture as well. So that's why this is significant and it's in great shape. Um, th th we're going to go in and see the ceiling which is going to be colorful and tiled. We are in the plaza of La Cathedral. Cathedral. And we're going to go inside. And what's inside right, the and, church? Uh, it's a colorful ceiling. But an, another item are the bell towers. The bell towers begin to change at this point, and it, they become square or octagonal. Okay. So that's what we're doing. We'll leave it there.